We are here at Anaheim, California. Man, it was pretty cool about Anaheim. It's the fact that it has a Jollibee on the left and it has a Red Ribbon Bake Shop. Now, we're definitely gonna be checking out as much food as we possibly can. <laughs> so, if you're ready, I'm ready, it's time to get our eats here at Red Ribbon Bake Shop. Let's go. Red Ribbon Bake Shop was established back over in 1979. Now we're actually celebrating 44 years. Now it was established back in the Philippines, but the Jollibee actually got their hands on it in 2015. Dude, this is so cool. Anytime, like I said, anytime you see a Jollibee, there's always a Red Ribbon somewhere around the corner or right next to it. All right, guys, so we're definitely gonna be starting this out. We're definitely gonna be trying is, now let me know in the comment section below, but yes, this is called a a la ball. Right, if I'm saying it wrong, sorry about that, guys. But it has some eggs in it as well, too, some green onions. Uh, but yeah, let's definitely just dig right into this, guys. The smell actually is there. I like the smell. Look at that. And it slides right off, guys. <laughs> All right, here we go. Bottoms up. That right there was really good. Oh, man. Every bit of that tastes really, it's like sweet. A little bit of savory on it, but more sweet to it. But it's not as sweet oh that tastes really delicious it really is good every bit of that the noodles the taste of the noodles with the, some of the sauce enriched it a lot better this right here is really delicious i would say oh uh, i would say this would this would this would be a six this would be a strong recommendation for adventure from adventures with david this i believe is like six dollars so this is one to try mm. So we're gonna definitely try two different things. One is a, the original and one is a spicy empanada. This one is the original uh, empanada. So that's definitely digging guys. Now let's try the spicy one. And it's all red. All right, here we go. Wow, the battle between both empanadas, I think at the most part, from in my opinion, the spicy empanada actually won that one. It was really good. It was, really, it was the spice wasn't actually potent on you like uh, like a jalapeno, but it was spicy enough. I would say if you don't like it spicy, get the regular chicken empanada. But if you want a little bit more kick to it and a lot, like in my opinion, a lot more flavor, would be the spicy empanada. Here we go. The ube mamon. Oh, it's all blue like a blueberry. Or like a boysenberry. Oh, oh yeah, that smells good. <laughs> here we go. What color is that? I think it's purple. Yum, yum, yum. <laughs> All right, here we go. Oh, so, smells so good. Nice and fluffy. Okay, the tang is there. It's a little sweet. It's not so heavy and dense. Okay, that right there, guys, a five out of six. That was really good. <laughs> it reminded me when I first saw it into like a boysenberry. God, yes. Now it's a butter mamon. This is like the battle of mamon. This is the best seller. Here we go, the unveiling of how it looks on the side. That's the most important part, guys. Look at that. It's so blueberry. It's so sweet. All right, that right there, that was really good. That butter is so is so perfect to go with this, how it fluff and taste. What are you doing to me, Red Ribbon? You made me want to buy more of these. This one would be a six. Cheese time. Uh, there's no unveiling on this one because it's just cheesy. I like my joke sometimes. I don't know how to, how to feel about this one. It has a strange texture to it. <laughs> it's like I like I like the sweetness to it, but the cheese kind of kicks it on there. Mmm. -hmm. I don't know. I don't know how to feel about this one. I would say this would be a this would be a four. This is a refreshing blend of shaved ice with a signature whipped to uh, mango topping made from real Philippine mangoes, leche flan. Fruits, beans, beans, and milk. Fuck, fuck, fuck. Here we go, guys. It definitely tells the shaved ice on this thing. Friends of ours actually tried this, so it kind of inspired me to actually get it myself. That's obviously, it is we're here at this big shop. Bottoms up, guys. What? That works. There's like so many flavors in my mouth right now that's just like popping, you know? That ice cream was really good. That custard was amazing. Wow. This is a $6 dessert you guys need to definitely try when you're here at Red Ribbon. That's amazing. You know, I've been actually sitting there and actually eating the, you know, delicious desserts that are on there. And I think it's actually, it's pretty cool. I was actually watching people come in and out 
Some people had their Jollibee, you know, their little plates from uh, from the other shop, and they came they came over here to get the dessert. So again, if you guys do stop by Jollibee, definitely come on by the Red Ribbon Shop right around the corner and get yourself a dessert because you're gonna need it, man. Trust me. Their desserts in general, man, are filling me up. Man, there was so much food that I had here at Red Ribbon. If this video definitely helped you out on your next fun adventure out here at Red Ribbon Bake Shop, or actually even you found something that you want to try, definitely make sure you guys do get this awesome video a thumbs up. And if you love these adventures, going to theme parks, conventions, expos, and awesome food places like this, and you want to actually follow me, make sure you guys are subscribed. But you're, if you're already subscribed, welcome back, guys. And now we are onward to the next fun adventure. Let's go.